FNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Hi folks, Basil Chapman here. This is Monday, the 11th of November. Monday, the 13th of November. I guess we almost lost a couple of days there. With the Dow down 34 at 34,249. In my show coming up, the Tiger Technicians Hour, I'm going to talk about the support levels, what they mean, how they should function, how the, how the upside uh, expansion will depend on just how deep any pullback here is, and we'll go through that. So in the meantime, back at the ranch, you got the S&P also down a little bit, down at 20 at 4,395. You've got the QQQ also giving back some from Fabulous Friday, down 2.73 at 375.62. The IWM, the Russell 2000 small caps, uh, down $1.50. Gold trying to form some kind of a base here, but it just keeps sliding, pulling away from the 200-period moving average magnet, uh, 1936. And the dollar is holding really well when you think about it. I spoke about this. I'll talk about it again when I get back from my show in a few moments' time. The Tiger Technicians Hour, how this nine-period moving average so far above the 14 says the dollar still has quite a bit of strength. Looking at bonds, bonds are down um, a point at 112 and a half. This is really interesting because it is off the low, but wow, it's a real struggle to get some momentum to the upside and sustain it. Crude oil is moving up. It's up 77 cents to 77.93. Might have made a, a bit of a low at the 75 level. We'll see if it can break into the 80, um, 79 to 80 area by the end of the week. That's going to be important. Meantime, it's, it's been acting very poorly. Now it's trying to establish some kind of a base. So what we're going to be looking at in the next hour is where the support levels are, what's working, what has been on fire, Will, will the sectors that are leading continue to lead and all the sectors that have been uh, sluggish, are they starting to come back? That's going to be important. And what you would expect by this coming Friday if you are very bullish or if you're becoming very bearish. So I'll be back in a moment. A lot to talk about. Uh, let's see. And just as we go out, the Dow is now down. About 41 points after the almost 400 point move to the upside. This is like an eye blink intraday. But the day is young. We'll be back and we'll talk about that. See you in a few months.